Hey guys, my name is Simpsy and welcome back to some more Total War Attila. We are playing the co-op with the Ostrogoths and the Visigoths. Yeah, this time let's, so. get, let's get a more interesting and epic battle. Well, I, I don't know how we can top the last one. I don't, oh I don't think we'll get better than that. That's, that's, it it yeah. was pretty horrendous. Mm. And I shall now raise this place to the ground, content in the fact that we will uh, never have to redo that battle. Burn. Burn for your hideousness. Drop the boast. Based? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, um, I will... Are we going further south when we move in your turn, or...? Um, yeah. If we go any further west or north, it's going to hit western. I think we should keep on hitting the eastern. Yeah, yeah. Anyway. Okay, you want to... Yeah, we'll, yeah, okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll take we'll, our time and grow a bit more powerful, because we... It makes sense, we'll seeing as we've rushed them pretty hard yeah, at yeah. the moment. So we're taking... Yeah. Four settlements, anyway. and then my... Your turn. Yeah. I'm taking the gold mine. They won't have trade from Thessalonica anymore, so that's mm. a pretty big bonus. I've almost got 10 grand in gold. Yeah, and we're also... Oh, yeah, because you get 3,000 per turn as the Western Roman Empire, so they're getting crippled as well, mm. I guess, through trade. So... I hope Daisha doesn't get wrecked. Even if it does, you can go back up north and kill him again. <laughs> Says waiting for player. Um, it's probably waiting for my turn. Yeah. Again, you've got a new computer. Oh, okay. All right. I just uh, never saw it. Slower turn to uh, turn time. Oh fuck! Yeah. All right. Bastanians, Roxolanians, Mukomans, and Vandals. Yeah, just a bunch of fuck off tribes warring with each other. <laughs> <laughs> right. Um, should Royals. I camp this term? I don't know um, what to do. Uh, now nah, move down towards you. Yeah. As, if you can only uh, use fifty percent, then camp here. Yeah. Uh, but is the rivalry penalty that bad? Uh, it's it's not so bad. It's better to avoid it if you can, but uh, it's not the end of the world if you don't. It, it's better that you're camped, even if you have the rivalry. Okay. It, it gets well, really bad if you have like four stacks in one region. Okay, but we're all going to camp and cluster together. I don't think it affects Ready for each other. It's just from factions. Okay, well, I guess we'll soon find out. Um, I don't know what to build here. Well, from industry, commercial, food, does Germanic... It, does it stack or is it just one buff and doesn't... Ready for I, I guess just go back with... Uh, I, I, uh, hmm. <laughs> I don't know. What are you doing? I'm trying to think, should I put more money into food or economy? Um, food, probably food. Food for now, probably. Yeah. It's saying we're going to get money from sacking and whatnot. Yeah, m money's not too big of a deal. Legend of Wiz has like over 10k and he's constantly rubbing it in my face. <laughs> I'm just trying to get as close as possible. Right, we'll camp here. You probably could have gotten away with camp... Uh, Camping just over the north of that border, save you the road. Yeah. Right? No, it's a part of the same region. No, no, slightly north of it isn't in that little forest bit. Oh, okay. Doesn't matter too much. Oh well. Right, I'm gonna decimate these armies. Ready for battle. Slightly more. The well. barbarianist faction has decimation. Yeah, that's what I thought as well. Right. Um, diplomacy wise, I don't think there's much else we can do. Nah, not right. Geppards, Dacia, Bastanians. If, you got ca if you've got cash to spare, you could probably convince some people to attack the Eastern Roman Empire and, like, in the East to make our lives easier. I guess. I can get a military alliance with the Bastanians. I'm going to try to squeeze a thousand out of them. <laughs> the Bastardians. I think that's what they're called, <laughs> Is aren't that they? What they're called? That's an awesome name if that's actually Bastar what they're called. Bastar. Bastar. You're Bastardians. <laughs> I think it's called that's what it's called. Bastards. I, I just say it so confidently that yeah. people disagree with me. <laughs> you're probably you're you're probably right, but uh, that is an awesome name all the same. Okay, right. Um I do have a fair bit of money, but I'm kind of just hoarding it. Yes. Get it? Ah, <laughs> uh, you're bad you're that's just, that's just bad. Ugh. That I don't even know what that was. That wasn't even anything. No. <laughs> it wasn't even a pun. <laughs> right. Um, uh, Daisha. Gruth Hungarians. 
I don't think there's many people in the East. Maybe the Bastanians will join the war against the Romans. Mm. I mean, mainly you just want the Sassanids attacking them, but if you take a look at our bonuses, no, do you have this as well with the Great Migration? We get plus 250 growth when we settle. No. I probably should recruit a spy, though. I didn't know we could do that. Can we do that off the bat? I think you need... I can. Um, can you? All right, sweet. I can do it straight off the bat. It costs 1,000. That's a bit hefty, but it's probably worth it to scout Constantinopolis. Hmm. Well, the Saxons, I had to build the right fucking Yeah, building. certain factions have to build it. Yeah. Right, I'm going to end a turn. It's back to you, big boy. Yeah, don't call me that anymore. <laughs> <laughs> That's just gay. You, you, you'll end up having that damn comment that you've got on one of your fucking FIFA videos, which asks if you had a gay experience when you came over to Britain. Oh, Jesus. I, I read that one. That was the best <laughs> comment ever. Man, it's like just like fan ah. fiction and stuff. Oh, good lord. I have a spy, so I wouldn't imagine the garrison at Dirachium would be very big. I don't know. Were you talking about your traits before? Is that what you were saying? Yeah, if you look up the traits, I have a thing called the Great Looking Migration that gives you plus 250 growth when we... Uh, when we oh, that's awesome. Hmm. So imagine you, you doing was... that at Rome. Or ah, shit. <laughs> Fucking what? hell. What? I, I moved when one of, one of my, my forces had a uh, force march on from the previous turn. Yeah, yeah. I forgot that one of my forces had force march. Oh, still. no. So, it's got, yeah. It's going to hit winter. Yeah. It, it's, that, it's that really shitty beaten up army. Yeah, yeah. So it's not too bad. But it, I would have uh, encamped right here on the opposite side of the border and lost the uh, rivalry trait. I still lose mm. it, <clears throat> which is nice. But oh, well. My main, my main army is encamped. Yeah. Which I've got a pretty cool trait as thing. well. It's called the Inheritors of Rome. No instability when occupying settlements from Roman factions. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Yeah. Can recruit Roman units in settlements. Just wondering. I can't see anything. Do you need any money? No, I've got like 10 grand. I'm just wondering, do we have military uh, access? I don't think we have need it as hordes, do we? No. Have you met the... Bastanians. I guess you could negotiate with them, maybe try to squeeze some money. Because we, I have a military alliance with them. Uh, I shall call they might want to get it. With... I'll have a look, yeah. They're pretty far north. They're up near Petrodova. Can I, recruit... I don't know. Yeah, I, I can recruit agents as well. So these southern yeah. guys can, but everyone else can't, apparently. What do we have from these guys? Germanic Warband. I do want the Germanic Warbands. They are quite nice. We're getting those. Mm -hmm. At least they're a lot better than the shit I got now. Uh, who are about the Bastonians? They're to the north. Uh, you might Bastar not have found them. Bast Bastarnians. Bastarnians? Bastarnians or yeah. Bastarnians? I don't know. Bastarnians sounds like it has a D in it. I don't know. I I'm not the right person to ask when it comes to pronouncing <laughs> shit. <laughs> no, I know. So. Me and you were just horrendous. Mm. What, <laughs> do you, what do you got with them? You've got a military alliance with them. I have a military alliance with them. Uh, I think I'll just get like. I, yeah. I squeezed some money out of him. It's like, what's like the percentage if you ask off a defensive alliance? It might be like. It's moderate. It might be like. You might be able to squeeze like 500 from him. Maybe maybe yeah. it's not worth it. Low, moderate shit. I managed to get a non aggression pack with him, which should raise my. Okay. It should raise my friendship with him, and then I can squeeze some money out of him later. That's how friendship works in real life. Ugh. I want to try to get peace with the Huns. I don't like them being enemies with me. Yes, that, that's how friendship works in real life, ladies and gentlemen. Simpsy came over. I made him buy me a burger. What? Oh yeah, yeah. right. But you, you, you did technically like waste an entire bag of perfectly good ammunition. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh Jesus. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember shit. Which is my superpower. Anyway, uh, there is like fuck all for me to do. Basically, we're just slowly moving down, and I've screwed myself with the force march thing. But oh well. It wasn't a whole bag. <laughs> Yes, it was. It was an entire little bag thing that I gave you. Okay, it was. Being the useless Australian that you are, you fell over or tripped on something or something. Oh, no, I was you. tactically running. I ran into a <laughs> tree to get running. cover, which is, like, even worse. There was mud all in the bag, and he was like, can you clean this? I was like, no, we're useless. It exploded. Just bin oh. them. <laughs> It was crazy because I was like shooting because I didn't realize straight away. And I was like, I, I looked down and I was like, fucking hell, I've been rinsed here. These guys are just, oh, wait, it's the bag. I, was like, I thought guys were just going ham. Just, <laughs> yeah. just wrecking me. Oh, man, I, I, I wish Airsoft was in Australia. My God. It is quite fun. So good. I only ever do it like once a month nowadays, but 
It's still yeah. it's still fun when you go. Even when we smashed and we won. Oh yeah. Like that's so I've just got like that that, that was rare as usually as well. Thank when you. I usually go with my cousin, we get like annihilated. We usually yeah. end up on the on the losing team. It's like the first time we've ever went when I did, we just completely destroyed. Yeah. Oh, what the hell? What's going on? I've got a minus 15 armor to command force, but a plus 10 attack and plus 10 movement speed. Hmm. Okay. Movement speed is nice. Yeah, I thought it was bad when I saw the minus armor, but it's probably not too bad. Right. I'm going to move my spy over to Constantinopolis <laughs> to see the garrison. Mm -hmm. That's going to be interesting. Um, are we going to push? Where am I pushing? Where should we push? It's winter, so we can't, I don't think. Uh, we... Oh, no. We're it's not, not too bad in Greece. nutrition right now in Greece. <clears throat> I call it um, nutrition, by the way. Nutrition? Yeah, it's not nutrition. <clears throat> it's not attrition, it's nutrition. <laughs> I've got okay. le I've got legends saying it as well. It, it's a thing. It's, it's going to stick. Well, they starve, so they are losing nutrition technically, I guess. Mm -hmm. But... Right. Um, are we going to hit on? Are we going to hit Dyrachium? Uh, yeah, we wipe out Dyrachium and then uh, the place way down in the south, which should just be for from now on, will be named Sparta. <laughs> it's just named Sparta. It's, it's pretty far north to be Sparta, though, isn't fucking it? Fucking oh, okay. no Northern Sparta. Right. <laughs> Northern okay, Sparta. Uh, and then uh, on the way down and the one on the way north, we can camp every turn and uh, get more growth and increase our hordes. So when we reach oh, Constantinople, oh. what? I'm, I can't go into Horde. It didn't tell me how much, like, movement points I had. It grows it out. It, it, like, goes... Shades out the movement points, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm being way too... Amb I can't even get hardly anywhere. So, like, here. That was where I can move. <laughs> I overshot massively. Yeah. Oh, wow. Uh, right. um, I can force march back. Probably safer. Uh, probably. Wait, no, no, no. You, you should have just stayed there. I had to move down and help you. Yeah. Oh, well. Oh, well. Right. Technology-wise, yeah, I'm going to try to get these Roman cohorts and stuff. <laughs> yeah, That'd be awesome. Uh, my guys have excellent cavalry. Is my thing. How's your family tree going? Uh, I what have... did you start off with? I have a bastard son, a bastard daughter. Well, no, no. My brother has a bastard son. I have... Yeah. I have my son who's married to your... Your daughter? Yeah. Mm. Who I can't click on. She's got abs, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's what the little symbol is. Oh, yeah. No, she has um, plus two influence per turn, plus two integrity when... Husband's commanding and plus one authority. So she's actually really good. <laughs> but she hasn't had any, any children. They haven't consummated the marriage. I don't well, know. They it, have, it was they my haven't. daughter marrying yours, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, your daughter married. Because I have <clears throat> I have my king. He has a sister who has a has a legitimate daughter. He has a legitimate son. But the king's brother is a bastard who's married to um, your daughter. Yeah, one of yeah. your daughters. Uh, I have a illegitimate son who's my heir. I don't think hordes and barbarian units trying to give a shit about bastards. Oh no! So it's, it's all cool. I wish you could legitimise them in this though. I have eight growth. Do you usually start off with eight growth? I could swear the Where Saxons didn't, but the Saxons were never a horde to begin with. I just got my ass kicked. <laughs> yeah, they probably don't have the horde buffs as like traditional horde shit! does. I did it again! Oh no. <laughs> What's the thing at direct no! I did it again, CMC. <sighs> Shit, I was wondering why the hell I could move so far. Is he in a forced march? Yeah. Okay. Uh okay, I um I could take this Dyrampy in place immediately again, but I'd lose. Man, you won't be able to do it. Last time we had hmm? two oh, no, full I'm stacks in with my, with of my pikes. full stack. Oh, yeah. I reckon just run in there. Uh, that's one thing. Either, either way, I'm going to lose all my... Did you recreate your spy? Place. No, not yet. I'm going to do that next... 
Uh, actually, yeah, I'll probably play it safe, recruit my spy before we go in. Yeah. Good thing, Exibzi. If only On now point. you could remind me that fucking turn off Force March. Now I'm on Force March. I'm going to remember it, definitely. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, farmer, that's... How the hell... Markanopolis. Can you put a spy inside a horde? Like, join them with it? I don't know. You might be able to with a priest, but... Well, my oh. spy has the farmer trait, which gives me plus 10 wealth for... Uh... I don't know. Maybe it's just because he's near a... T um, maybe. I don't know. I... Th I, yeah, I don't know. I haven't had much experience with spies. Mm. I didn't recruit them to the late game in my campaigns. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm just going to go with a spy that's got the spy master trained, it appears. Okay. <laughs> it just, just seems to be the most logical. My vassal state, Dacia, has a pretty big garrison, nine units to the north. Hmm. I guess I could send them to attack. <laughs> I'll get them to attack Constantinopolis first. <laughs> As if I haven't had a battle yet. What the hell? <laughs> Mind you, it's only episode two. I could even bully Daisha to give me some money. <laughs> well, you did, you did save him. Well, Daisha wants a non-aggression pact, sure. Yeah. yeah. Don't you dare squeeze the money out of him. Hmm? Nah. Oh, no. They just got declared war on upon the... Uh, fuck by the Western Roman Empire. They have quite a large... They have 13 units and their garrison, so they might be <laughs> able to hold in there. All right. Okay. At Constantinopolis, there's uh, a nine units, so that's probably... Not too bad because it's we pretty probably big could have pushed on them immediately and killed them. Yeah. To be honest, um, our little alliance of these two factions is probably OP as shit. <laughs> yeah. Um, but it, it's fun either way. So. I could even just go after that army that's pushed out here just to level up my spy so I can assassinate him. Well, you remember, you separate your forces too much, it can be quite risky. Yeah. Successful. Okay. Sweet. Hindered army at Constantinopolis. Hmm. All right, we'll get out of forced march immediately. Yes. Forced I guess we'll save her. The devil. Until we can get this wood carver, so we can get some Roman units. Right. What am I doing? Where should I push? Should I just push south to Corinthos, or um, or should I try to get rid of this want Roman to push army directly south, or come with me? I'm pretty sure I'll be able to take this Dyrachium place. Yeah, I think you'd be pretty well right, honestly. Um. I'm trying to think where I can hold. I guess on the other side here. So here we'll move. I'll go back into encampment. Move this guy. I might hold this choke point, but it might not be needed. Get back into horde. And you have 1400. I actually don't have that much money. Right, Dacia, give me some money. <laughs> well, you, you did free them from their uh, Roman overlords, so they might, you know. They might be inclined. They are your bitch. They so. did. They gave me 600 yeah. for nothing. Nice. Nice. Not Thanks, bad, Dacia. Actually. I actually yeah. can set a co-war... Um, a a co-war co target thing. Wouldn't yeah. I don't know why I couldn't say it. It's way too early here. <laughs> Still, um, I guess I could get them to attack Marcanopolis. That's north of Constantinopolis. It's a bit across. Yeah, may as well get them to attack. However, they just got declared war on by the Western Roman Empire. If they leave their lands, they're going to get destroyed. So, no. Nah, it doesn't <laughs> uh, i got some... Coincidentally, they're called the Champions of Italy. Hmm. That's the, the name of their thing, is the Champions of Italy. They're not in Italy. Probably nowhere near enough to what they want to. Oh, did you want to move your spy? Yes, we will. Where are you sent yours? Use your to Constantinople. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I will send mine down towards these idiots then. Yeah, Corinthos. Yeah, there's no point in both of us having to spy in the same area. No, uh, I guess you could send it up once you've looked down there, probably to Salonia, and uh, have a look at it the. It looks western. like they're pretty shitty and beaten up down here. They've got five units. What's in yeah. their garrison? They are they are raising oh, forces. Their garrison actually is pretty strong. It's oh, it's not really, but it's stronger than what we've been. Yeah, we probably both want to go down there because they are they are recruiting. Yeah. Okay. That might be a decent battle to play then. Yes. Uh, 
Okay. Um, we'll upgrade you to get the sacking bonuses for that because I do I love my you. money. I probably should give some officers. He can be a companion, I guess. Oh, I can't do it, but it said I could. What? <laughs> Um, I guess you might want to do a, a hard save. Oh no, it's up to you though, because you're hosting. Uh, yeah, probably. It might be a good idea. Yeah, we'll go here. And we'll camp. I'm going to camp on the way down, so I might lag behind you a little bit. Yeah. But if I go along the coast, you go straight shot down, and we meet up around where my spy is, and we uh, go from there. Yep, sure. I don't believe there's much else for me to do, really. Where's labor service in my tree? Labor service? Yes, yeah, the second one down, okay. Because uh, I'm going to need food if I'm going to upgrade my horde. Although, to be honest, I may, like, start my horde by taking Constantinople and settling that. Because I think that'll be set a, a set and awesome. Yeah, well, I just think we got great migration things, which gives us plus 250 growth when we settle. Yeah. And uh, I, I think it would be funner if we if we settled up and made our own little empires. Kingdoms, yeah. Yeah, if, if, I, like, if I went to the east and started building and you went to the west. I guess Rome. Yeah. I guess Rome's probably the biggest city nearby. Hmm. Or even Carthage. That'd be kind of cool. Because we've got that climate change coming. And... Yeah, yeah, it Italy's good, but like I said, uh, the Ostrogoths, you guys are... Uh, oh, we are Roman, so yeah, we, we kind you, of are. You, well, you kind of are. You're like the successors to Rome, or you call yourselves it. Yeah. Anyway, uh, we'll do your turn, and I'll yabber on there. Yeah. Again, my tiny-ass mediocre stack gets no fucking... <laughs> no migration uh, growth bonuses. Okay, so that army's moved back to Constantinopolis. Uh-huh. So that's going to be a pretty big battle when it happens. I guess I'll push up through the south of Italy and Sicily. Hmm. Or I guess I could push E. I don't know. Well, uh, help me secure Constantinople first. Oh my god, they just ran from Constantinople. Good lord. They're running north. Let's quickly and... go over there and steal their shit. Okay, and that army from Corinthos has just marched out. Yeah, yeah. I could actually take Constantinople probably. But I can't gift it to you. Yeah, you can't gift it shit to me. So no. Just leave it for now. We'll go up there later. Yep. Yep. And that army from Corinthos has just marched out. Yeah, yeah. So. If you encamp, if you, we might want to join up if he's going to attack us. Yeah. Although, to be honest, he's only got so many troops, he won't be able to take on. I haven't attack. actually fought a camped battle. The mm -hmm. Abdanians. Even are at war with. Does it? Does it just look like a ground, like wasteland? I, or I, don't, or? I don't know. It might be like. Um, um, I don't know, just have like huts in the background, like some battles have. I don't know. Maybe. All right, be at war with the Gruth Hungarians. Yeah, no thanks. I only get a thousand. But yeah, we'll, right. uh, we'll grow our, our, our horde power, mainly you, especially. You grow your horde power up when we go down south, mouth, south of March. Here, what do you mean, we... grow horde power? Well, you encamp every turn, you get uh, growth, and you can buy the buildings and stuff. And oh, okay. And shit. I didn't know that. Yeah, by the, by the time we. Yeah, yeah. You, you only get growth when you're encamped. That's why you should try and be encamped at the end of every turn. Okay. And you avoid the rivalry bonus, you get more money and more growth. Nice. Right, I'm I still losing 200. From Legend. Yeah. I'm losing 200 per turn. Are you? Are you got? Um. Hmm? Are you making a profit? I'm still making negative. How are you making negative? I'm making 550 every turn. It's because I think I got one of my things are encamped. I have to defeat Lego thingamajig. Yeah, I get a grand if we defeat that army. That army down in the south? Yeah. Really? The faction there for uh, the Eastern Roman Empire just got a mission. Kill them and I, I get a grand. My mission was to kill some tribe in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> yeah, I love that. And <laughs> the Gruth Hungarians who were like, I think it's in like Crimea, the, Crime the Crimeas. But I want like non aggression packs and stuff with them, I think I have, maybe. Dacia has 17 units. Oh, my God. Yeah, you, you did get a, a nice little bit there. Yeah, for some reason, I can give Dacia to them, but, like... Oh, I think we could have got Macedon somewhere. 
I'm going to be interested to see what the AI is going to do here. Are they going to go for me? Are they going to go for you? Or are they going to run back to Corinthos? I would run if I was them. <laughs> Plenty of guard in the garrison. Um, you probably could get your spy to... Um, I can't remember what it's called, but you can get them to uh, give them... Mis uh, misdirect them, yeah. Yeah, that's misdirect, that's it. That might make their movement points. Hinder. Not, yeah, yeah, or hinder. Misdirect. I have a 45% yeah. chance. I do not have that kind of luck, but we'll do it. I'll just put that there. Work, 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 work. I think he's the heir, so... That's correct. Failure. Ah. Yeah. Flavius. Someone. Yeah. Oh, he might be the heir. I, he does have the trait uh, useless or something, which is like gives him minus 5% for succeeding. Okay. Which is not great. Just looking at the buildings that I can build, as it were. Just thinking whether or not it's worth building horde buildings when I'm going to settle Constantinople <coughs> in theory. Ah. Uh, Probably well, not. No, probably not. I guess I haven't quite hit that yet, but I will soon. Hmm. I'm just building food buildings. I think that's really all we need because we might have a crap summer or winter and they could cripple us quite heavily. I, I guess yeah. save it. You can always go back to Horde if you want to. but uh, Yeah, but like I said, yeah, I think it'd be funner if you... If we like rebuild the East and Western Roman Empires, or, or the mm -hmm. the Goth Empires, nice. And I do kind of have like an eagle as my banner, kind of. Thing. Yeah, I think historically the Visigoths, I think they were in Iberia. I, I have think. no idea. Anyway, well then the turn and uh, that easy whatever. Because you isn't your isn't your general called Alaric, your king, sorry or something? Um, I'll have a look. I have no idea. I think it's Alaric. Maybe. Or maybe, maybe I'm Alaric. Swinkly, it's a Wikipedia. Quickly give a history lesson. Yeah. I did that with I the know, Vandals. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Legend was wondering whether there was any connection to the Vandals and the word Vandals. Oh. There is. <laughs> okay. They ran. Oh. There's a full stack. Oh, the Allens might be besieging Constantinopolis, man. Not a full stack just shit. rocked up. Yeah, there's and also a full stack of uh, yeah. Romans there as well. So. Over on Asia Minor. No, I don't really know much about this time period historically. Nah. I know little bits, but nothing really interesting. Yeah, <laughs> no, I didn't really play Barbar uh, Barbarian Invasion all that much for Rome 1, <laughs> the expansion. No. Nah. Yeah. Okay. Roman logistics system. So I can finally get some Roman units. Sweet. I think it's going to be longer for me before. Why can't I construct that? Shouldn't it just be in the thing? I have a spare construction site, but I can't build the wood carver. That makes sense. Uh, don't you need... Or maybe I need the resource wood. Wood resource for, yeah. Uh, shit. Well, I guess once I... Ugh. So, you, you keep saying that uh, we're a horde and we shouldn't settle, but we have a... We're, this, we're a migration horde, where the idea is yeah, to eventually you're settle. Yeah, you're right. And well, we, I guess these... we get 250 growth when we settle. Yeah. So... I think... Well, it's not going to be that much of a problem. I'm going to be able to use these technologies l later... I guess I'm kind of hindering myself now, though. Hmm. I don't know. What are you going through? Military or civic? Uh, I went through military at the first to get my Germanic warband guys upgraded, and now I'm going civic to get some upgrades to my food supplies. Yeah, I think I might change it now. Because I thought it'll be out. Yeah. I did it I thought first, it been but a I needed some food. Yeah, I'll go with some more food bonuses. All right. Okay. I'm going to send this army, sorry, this spy over to... Asia mine and try hinder this. I can ruin the provisions, probably not just yet. But I'll misdirect and hopefully we can hold them there for a little bit. Failure. God damn it. 
Right. Where's that army from Corinthos gone? Did that push over? Where did it go? Huh? Uh, they went back down south past Corinthos. Might have taken ship or something. I'm not sure. I'll send my spy over in my turn and have a look. It's a slow process, this. Yeah. There is a lot of doing shit all. Especially in a head-to-head. -head. It's just like a giant game of chess. Whoever makes the first fucking mistake basically loses the game. Yeah. Goat herd or a sheep flock? Depends on fertility and if you're going to have room. Well, if you settle in later on, but you won't be settling for a while. So. Yeah. This place has we'll go. good fertility, though. So. Well, should I go with goat herd or sheep flock then? I don't know. Goat, I think, is better in like worse climates or something. Yeah, I'll go with sheep flock. And I can't do anything else. Right. Um, diplomacy, what else have we got? The Allens. I won't make anything with them because you're probably going to attack them if they take Constantinopolis. Yeah, if they take it, I want that place. Although, if they burn oh. it to the ground. <laughs> oh, God. I'll have to find a new home. Um, probably, yeah. Probably Alexandria or something. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to think of some other big territories. Rome, Carthage. Yeah, Alexandria would be probably a really good one. Mm. And then pretty far south from there, there's a there's like a spice resource, which is like one of the only couple in the game, and you get like a thousand per turn. <laughs> Sweet. Okay, you can go there. Shit, I'm going into debt. Uh, I probably want to. You might. I guess you could disband that other army. I don't know. Uh, I disband. Two of these pikemen and that orager. Oh shit, I haven't done the officers yet. I keep on forgetting that. Yeah, I never really even pay much attention to that, to be perfectly honest. You get some nice buffs, but overall... Oh wow, some of them are really good. Minus 5% from construction, minus a plus 4% from agriculture. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're not great. You can live without them kind of thing. If you forget yeah. them, it's not the end of the fucking world by any means. Thirsty for battle. I guess I could send an army up to Dacia, and because they're my strappy, I can levy troops from, um, uh, what are they called? Tributary states in this. Yeah, tributary states. Tributary, yeah. I swear they, like I said, they change it every year. It's strappies, it's vassals, it's client states, it's... Yeah. <laughs> you should know what I'm talking about. <clears throat> yeah. The people... I, I think that army. Weird. Oh, we are slowly grouping up now. It looks menacing as hell. Yeah, I know. I'll be scared. Warriors all. Probably should have my bastard commanding that second army. I don't know about you, but on my screen, the roads are flickering. <laughs> yeah, um, I got that as well. I kind of zoomed out to like not pay attention to it. Yeah. Yeah, it's a little weird. A little weird. Uh, what have we got for diplomacy? Since you're looking at it, I may as well. I feel. Yeah, and probably just should do your offices. Yeah. Daisy likes me, at least. Don't you dare squeeze any money out of them. Find a welcome here and speak as you wish. I may have to join the war against the uh, Nubake. I don't know. I don't really need money. Yeah. Are you sure that they're your tributary state? No, I think they're, so. They're not, no. No. Yeah. They're just your military allies, so they're not giving you any money in return. I think they were, and then I made them my military allies. That might have been a mistake. Uh, I don't think that's how oh. it works. Once they give tributary state, that's it. Oh. Unless they, like, declare war on you. So I think they just became your, uh, your beer. Oh, no. maybe I've been saying that wrong then. Maybe. Oh. They're not too bad. They've got, they got a full stack now. Yeah. I can't really be bothered with... Diplomacy right now. I have so much cash. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Oh, the bat. The oh no, they're not the besieging. Okay. No. All right. Um, we will send my spy over here to keep an eye on some shit for now. Yeah, here they. Oh, are. they're sitting out. 
They're in range of the stuff, but they're sitting outside of it. I am the knife in the dark. How can I assist? What are my chances of hindering these guys? Yeah. Shit. The only reason you probably should do diplomacy at this point is just to get money. But Yeah, but I don't really need money. Right now. No. Uh, should I try and hinder these guys again? Yeah, why not? Probably gonna fail, because only 45% and I don't have that much luck. Yeah. Just fail. to just to level up your spy. Yeah, he did level up. Because then you can get poison provisions and okay, assassins. The Huns are fucking deadly if you're, like, chasing after them, but if you're the Romans, you can just <coughs> sit in tor uh, tortoise mode and let them use all their ammunition, and afterwards they just charge you and wrap yeah, them, yeah. in my spirit. <laughs> okay, that army yeah. is yep. moving. Yep. Or Go. what? Well, they didn't <laughs> attack you. <laughs> they didn't attack you. That's the one good thing. I think they're both in force march. We might be better off to go with a fortified stance, or maybe... Or... Yeah, maybe. Uh, the, the weird thing with the AI is it doesn't seem to be at all affected by force march or, or attrition or anything. Yeah. This is going to be a hell of a battle. Hmm. I've, I've, built, I've built quite a lot of cavalry, so... We do not yeah. give gifts lightly. These guys are awesome, these Dacia guys. What do they want? Nothing. Oh, no, 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 no. I thought they, I thought they were offering me 850. They're demanding 850. <laughs> uh, no. So they're just assholes now? <laughs> yeah, now, now they're assholes. For a moment, I thought they were really nice guys. Just randomly giving me 850 gold. <laughs> but now they well, the want something from me. Well, they're sacking... Western Roman Empire lands have pushed out. Right. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do. Yeah, uh, I'm going to put my... You might oh, want to move out into the open a little bit. And then fortify, I suppose. The fortified position is probably a lot better than just being in camp. Well, we could hold this choke point here, I guess. Uh, I'm thinking I have a lot of cavalry. So do I. I have four units. Yeah, but my cavalry is uh, a lot more experienced, I think, because that's my faction buff. Okay, right. Well, no, is it? Uh, I think that was the other guys that I was playing at. I'm not sure what my faction buff is. Oh, shit. What do you just do? We don't have um, fort. <laughs> don't we? No, we don't have fortified position. Right, I guess we could just like stand tall. <laughs> <laughs> this is the end of the series. No, they have seasickness, so if they do attack us, they're going to have that penalty. Um, looking at them, they're mostly just spearmen. We have swordsmen and archers. Uh, we do outnumber them as well, I think. Yeah. I have 20 units. Just move them. your forces so that they're like nearby yours, and then we'll, I'll move near you. Okay, so I'm going to put my stack behind me, my other one. Yeah, yeah. Um, it is winter at the moment. We won't lose attrition because we're too far south. Yeah. Right, I need to do some in of camp these. If you can, as well. Oh, I can, I think. Yeah, I've got enough. I'll encamp straight away then. You may as well, yeah. Right, I need to give some of my officers companion traits and stuff. See, this is another thing. Great thing about hordes, we have no cities to defend. Our armies are our cities. Oh shit! Yeah. Because otherwise, I'd be worried about where those guys are going to run off to and attack my cities. <laughs> True. We have none. I would like to get rid of this general, but we can't because we're about to have a war. Or a battle, that is. Yeah. I want to make my bastard son the commander of this other army, not this other prick. Can't you kick people out of armies? Yeah, but it takes a turn. Hmm. I'd much rather have the three-star general instead of the one-star just yet. Seems we're about to have a battle. Yeah. I would imagine. They might just run off. Well, they might attack me. Oh no, you have your turn before them. Yeah. I'll bring these fine gentlemen over here, for which we shall encamp. And just look at that giant horde bundle. It's a bit of a clusterfuck. Yep. But it's a glorious clusterfuck. Um, I'm just thinking of building more fucking cavalry. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Cavalry What's your army build look like? Pikemen. I'm not Got sure what the hell my faction's like buff is. Where can I see my faction's buff? 
Uh, go summary. Summary. Where the fuck is that? Um, just click on the oh, yeah, faction I see, and I summary. Uh, yeah, I've got blood money, uh, plus 10 food when migrating through Roman territory. That's sweet. And plus five, uh, 500 for the formation of tributary states. Money, that is. Yeah, it was those, uh, it was those angle guys, I think, that had the bonus to horses. Mm-hmm. Which I was interested in. Warriors old. Battle. But yeah, um, even though I don't have a bonus to horses, cavalry remains like the best fucking unit Ready ever. For orders. Germanic mounted war band, yeah, and especially because they can't recruit cavalry yet. We need good fighters. Macedon is rebelling in Corinthos. There is no finer ending. Yeah, I'm just gonna. Uh... I am just going to, <laughs> yeah, fuck it. I'll just recruit those horses, and worst case scenario, I can get rid of some shit later. But yeah, and I can get labor service, which is good. It gets me some food and free turns. Okay, we will end and see the moment of truth, I suppose. Will they attack us? Will be interesting. I'm thinking, shit. What is or is not my far ho 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 hall to the left within range of your one far to the right? It should be. I don't see why it wouldn't. Yeah, yeah, it is. I'm hovering over it. It is good. I thought I might have just screwed up there. <laughs> Here we go. The odds are pretty far, like, matched. I doubt they can pull it off. Oh, they're running. Yeah, they're running. Not running far. No. But I think, as long as we stick together, I don't think they have the forces necessary to beat us. Especially since I just built three, level, uh, three units of cavalry. But yeah, let's, uh, let's stay within range of each other. I guess we'll just push down to the next choke point. Yeah, we push down. We we stay encamped. So we st we gain some shit every turn. Okay, there's a Hunnic Horde pushing on Dacia. They just destroyed the Gepids, who were my military allies. <laughs> so I don't like having too many military allies or anything, as, at least as like the Western Roman Empire, because I don't like getting the AI dragged me into walls. Yeah. I was only really using any of this to get money. Hmm. We do not what the fuck, Dacia? And never First of all, they demand 850 from me, and now they want 640. <laughs> no! Fuck and then they And then they give it to me, probably, if I ask Probably. <laughs> They're fucking trying to uh, run a little extortion racket of, like, asking for shit from me and then giving it to you. 